For more community events, visit our website, kvgcradio.com. Hometown Radio for Amador and Calaveras Counties is KVGC Jackson, San Andreas, Sutter Creek, the voice of the gold country. From ABC News, I'm Brian Clark. The top seven Democratic presidential hopefuls are on stage tonight in New Hampshire for a debate ahead of Tuesday's primary. Senator Bernie Sanders said earlier that regardless of the nominee, the party must unite to defeat President Trump. Earlier today, he said the key for that are non-traditional voters turning out, but referring to the Iowa caucuses. While the voter turnout there was not as high as I had liked, you know what did happen? We saw a 30% increase in young people under 29 voting. If we're going to defeat Trump, we need a huge increase in young people's participation in the political process. And questions still remain after the chaos of the Iowa caucuses. The state Democratic Party pushed the deadline for campaigns to file a request to re-canvas to Monday at noon central. There are now 12 confirmed cases of coronavirus in the U.S. Today, Health and Human Services Secretary Alex Azar said, Although the virus represents a potentially very serious public health threat, and we expect to continue seeing more cases here. The immediate risk to the American public is low at this time. President Trump spoke about coronavirus with Chinese President Xi Jinping overnight. After offering testimony at the impeachment trial, Lieutenant Colonel Alexander Vindman is expected to be dismissed from his post at the White House National Security Council. President Trump would not say if Lieutenant Colonel Alexander Vindman is being pushed out of his position in the White House. Well, I'm not happy with him. You think I'm supposed to be happy with him? I'm not. Vindman testified during a House impeachment hearing. He was on the president's July phone call with the president of Ukraine, and he later raised red flags about it with his superiors on the National Security Council. Karen Travis. ABC News, the White House. The NTSB says wreckage from the helicopter that crashed last month, killing Kobe Bryant, his daughter, and seven others, showed no signs of engine failure. Still no information about the cause. You're listening to ABC News. 36 days. That's how long it takes the average company to find their next hire. Glassdoor only matches you with qualified job candidates, so you can find that perfect new hire in half the resumes. Go to glassdoor.com slash hire. Glassdoor. Find the right fit for your business. I've got 30 seconds to tell you about Jenny 30, the remarkable new weight loss plan from Jenny Craig. With Jenny 30, you can lose 5 to 10 pounds in 30 days. You get to eat the foods you love. No prep or cooking required. Plus, get personal support from a Jenny Craig coach and a personalized plan based on your DNA. See results in just 30 days. Dial pound 250 on your smartphone and say Jenny Craig to learn how to save $30 a week on Jenny 30. Dial pound 250 and say Jenny Craig. Upgrade to the wiper blades trusted by Rainer Zietlow to break world records. Michelin Endurance XD Silicone Wiper Blades are real-world proven for extreme weather performance that lasts two times longer than other blades. The new Michelin Endurance XD Silicone Wiper Blades are only available at Walmart. Sick and tired of American politics? A new study says you are not alone. The American Psychological Association has surveyed people about their stress, finding that 62% call the current political climate a source of angst. Chiropractor Jason West saw it firsthand when an assistant called him to the waiting room. Two of our patients are fighting. The source of the discord? One of them was on one side of the political issue, one of them was on the other. He broke up the fight and set a new policy. We had to make a rule that we don't show news in the office. The APA says that may be the best stress reducer, simply tuning out for just a while. Jim Ryan, ABC News. A million-dollar bust in Florida highlights a brutal industry. An estimated one million sharks are killed every year for their fins. Eva Lara with the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service after 1,400 pounds of illegal shark fins were seized in Florida. The way the fins are taken, nothing short of brutal. The fins are cut off while the animal is still alive and the dismembered body is discarded overboard. This one shipment of fins had a value of up to $1 million. Michelle Franz and ABC News. Surprise in South India, where residents of an apartment building turned on their taps and instead of water, got a mix of beer, brandy, and rum. The building was next to a bar that was closing. Bar workers poured about 1,600 gallons of beer, brandy, and rum into a hole next to the building. The alcohol seeped into the building's well. Could take about a month to clean. This is ABC News.
There's nothing like meeting face-to-face, -face, and there's nothing like Zoom to make that happen. Zoom lets you connect and do business across town or around the world. Zoom ties together all of your communication needs into one easy platform for video conferencing, phone calls, group chat, webinars, and your conference rooms. Connect easily from anywhere, your mobile phone, your laptop, or conference room. Zoom is how business gets done. Get your free account at zoom.com today. Meet happy with Zoom. Brian Clark, ABC News. Thirteen forty ninety six five KVGC, live in the studio on location today. We're here at uh, Louis Oliver's at Harris Northern California in the beautiful Jackson Valley of Amador County. Uh, with me today, we have Chairwoman. Rhonda Pope Flores, we have J.C. Rieger, General Manager, and Josh, who's the Director of Food and Beverage, is over there. Josh? How's it going? Good, good. What have we got? We got uh, something coming out from the from the chefs today? Yeah, we got we got some uh, some of our lunch items coming out from uh, the kitchen from our uh, head chef, and uh, here, we uh, a couple of our bartenders are here, and they're going to make our uh, cocktail of the month for, uh, for everybody for later. Great. And the folks from hospice are going to be here, and I think... Yes. This month, it's the, some of the proceeds. Yes, our go cocktail to of the month. We uh, we are donating a portion of the proceeds are going to hospice of uh, Amador. So great. All right, Josh, we'll yep. check back in with you in just a little bit. All right, bit. thank you. All right, again, we have uh, with us today uh, Tribal Chairwoman uh, Rhonda Pope Flores. Rhonda, good afternoon. Welcome. Thank Welcome. You. Welcome. And we have J.C. Rieger, J.C. General Manager. Uh, of the place so uh, yes what yes. what would you like to be called uh gc is fine <laughs> <laughs> Rhonda, what a beautiful uh, facility you have here i know you work very hard it was a dream long dream it uh, has come to fruition and so the first question i have for you louis oliver who is why why do we honor mm -hmm. this restaurant with the name louis oliver because louis oliver was my great grandfather mm -hmm. and um when we were thinking of um how to theme things. He came to mind because my great grandpa was always a gracious host, mm -hmm. all of our ceremonies and everything. And I thought, well, what better way to honor him than to have him here in this restaurant still being a gracious host? Are we going to sample any of his recipes? Or was he a good cook? Was he a good cook? Or was um, I think no. my grandma was the cook. <laughs> <laughs> right. He was the host. Yeah. JC, welcome. Uh, we've we've spoke before. You've been yeah. on the air. We've done some uh, some stuff with you as well. Yeah, before. absolutely. And, uh, yeah. Beautiful facility, man. Beautiful. Thank you, thank you. It's a labor of love. You know, you mentioned uh, Rhonda just uh, working to get this uh, built over the last uh, it seems like 17 years, and then <laughs> you know the quick uh, the the quick 13 month build, and then uh, the yes. the build up and the lead up to uh, opening day, and. You know, this April will be one year that we've been operating and mm -hmm. things are running smoothly. Uh, you know, you work out the kinks after the first few months. Yeah. And one thing that we really pride ourselves on is service. And uh, you're just proud of all the employees that are working here and providing great service that, uh, yeah. you know, just it's more about it. I'm from the Midwest, so it kind of has more of a Midwestern feel out here as opposed to the hustle and bustle of the city. So, yeah. mm -hmm. you know, it kind of makes me feel like home sometimes. Gotcha. Yeah. Rhonda, can you t tell me a little bit about the cultural center? that you have as you see as you drive up that that's been here for a, yeah, for a while that was yes. one of the first buildings built on this property wasn't it then? uh yes it was um the cultural center is to honor our miwok heritage in the area mm -hmm. um it's not open all the time um i open it for special occasions but it displays um a lot of historical articles about the area, the other local tribes, and it has a lot about our family and our heritage and, you know, just the importance of, you know, the Miwok people in it, Amador County. Is it available for, if, if, a, if a school, you know, wanted to come see it, like Absolutely. a group of school children, yes. uh, you know, in fourth grade, everybody studies California and, yep. and the missions and the so forth, yep. would you welcome that here? Uh, on yes, the property? I would absolutely. We actually did have one school uh, that approached us. It was Sacramento Unified mm -hmm. School District that came up, brought all the kids, and spent the whole day, uh, walked them around Whoa. the res, and um, they had lunch. They learned about our culture, and it was they just loved it. So yes, Great. absolutely. Great. Yeah. JC, when we also drove up, we saw this tent out here. Is it, <laughs> you want to what? Gonna be a big party there or something? Or? Um, 
Yeah, and you're invited. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, you know, with the lack of space, we don't have a big promotion space. So we do so, some uh, special events out yeah. there. We do our promotional Beautiful. giveaways out there. Just, to, you know, just being creative with what we have. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's, mm -hmm. uh, it's helped us quite a bit. Yeah. And there are future plans for expansion out here? Uh, yeah, you always hope so. You know, mm -hmm. you, as you know, as we start to grow and you're, we haven't master planned the, the whole area or anything, but that is something that is on the horizon that we would like yeah. to grow. Great. All right. Rhonda, thank you for the invitation to come here today. JC, thank you, thank you. for inviting us. And uh, we're going to continue with the rest of the show. We're going to sample some of the food from Louis Oliver's, maybe have a drink of the month, and uh, talk to some other guests. So thank you again for that. Okay? Thank, you. thank you. We'll be back with the news live from Louis Oliver's here at Heroes Northern California when we come back. <laughs> Explore the Wildlife Art Gallery at Charles Spinetta Winery for gifts to brighten any home. Our tasting room includes one of California's largest wildlife art galleries with original watercolors, pottery, sculpture, and hundreds of framed prints from dozens of artists. Our professional frame shop turns diplomas, family photos, and your favorite artwork into treasured heirlooms. Call 245-3384 to make an appointment with our framer. Charles Spinetta Winery is open on Steiner Road every day except Tuesday and Wednesday. Visit charlesspinettawinery.com for more information. Give your home a gift of wildlife art from Charles Spinetta Winery. As a business owner, you rely on your phone and internet for everything. How is that working these days? Missed calls? Buttons don't work? Internet crashes? A new phone system would be great, but expensive. Consider the hosted solution from Utility Telecom. Partnering with Volcano Vision, we can provide the newest in telephone technology, coupled with a rock-solid fiber internet connection and very attractive pricing. So get rid of your old phone system and join Utility hosted in the cloud today. Call us at 257-2020. That's 257-2020. Thirteen forty ninety six five KVGC way of how's it going? All's good over here. <laughs> how's everything over there? Good, good, excellent. So, uh, you want to introduce the bartenders for us today, or so Sean? Sean's one of our bartenders. Uh, he's going to be helping us out today by making our uh, February cocktail of the month. Uh, it's our chocolate espresso martini. And a uh, portion of the proceeds will be going to the Amador Hospice. So, um, yeah, it's a great cocktail. Uh, it's, a, it's a fun one for February also because of uh, Valentine's Day. So, um, so, yeah, so we're using uh, three olives espresso, uh, vodka. That's the most important part. Of course. Is he going to make it for us right now? He is. Yeah, yeah we're going yeah, yeah. to do it right now. Diva wine chocolate. That's good. Probably about an ounce. All right. We got ourselves some chocolate sauce. The chocolate sauce. Well, that's good. Is it going to be shaken or stirred? This will be shaken. This, shaken. Okay. this is definitely shaken. <laughs> right. so a little bit of half and a half. A little half and a half. Let me just grab a glass. And I think that Wendy, Wendy from Hospice, hey Wendy, Wendy, yeah, we'll set this to the side for Wendy from minutes. Hospice, you get on up there. You should be the first person to taste this. Seriously, this is the drink of the month. Yeah. So since we since we've been running this drink, it's it's been very popular, and the bartenders have been doing an excellent job, um, and it's definitely a, a pretty cocktail to look at too. Yeah. So Wendy from Hospice is with us today, and she should have the first sip of that. Definitely. Just to try it and tell us what, it, what it's like. And then she should bring it to me, and then I should probably drink the rest of it. Yeah, Just because. Is a raspberry liqueur on top. A little raspberry liqueur on top. That is a beautiful looking drink. There, there we go. go. Take a sip out of it. this is our espresso. Chocolate espresso martini. Wendy, step up. Don't be shy. Take a sip out of it. It's a sipping drink, remember. Sipping drink. Yes. <laughs> yes, it's a sipping drink. There we go. Very good. And the best part of this is that the proceeds, a, a portion of the proceeds from this, 
all month long go to Hospice of Amador. That's correct. All right. So yeah. Good deal. Yeah. Hey, yeah, we'll get back pleasure. with you guys in just a bit. No, Wendy, you're not supposed to. Bring it to oh, bring it to me. Oh, of course. <laughs> Come on over all right. Thank you. We'll be back with you in just a bit. All right. All right. Let's take a look what's going on in the way of local news for today. Well, the El Dorado National Forest will continue its annual prescribed burn program as weather conditions allow. This month, pile burning is planned on the Amador Ranger District along Highway 88, Forest Meadows, Cat Creek, and the Power Fire areas. The actual burns will depend on weather and air quality conditions, which course will limit the number of days that prescribed burns can take place. 2019-20 burn program will include the continued use of prescribed fire in several high priority projects including the power fire fueled maintenance studies. Now if you want more information on this you can always visit the uh, El Dorado National Forest website or call the Amador Ranger District office. Former Calaveras County businesswoman Vona Hughes is behind bars today following an appearance in court yesterday. Calaveras Superior Court Judge David Sanders refused to release the former owner of an Angels Camp pet grooming business from jail, instead ordering that she receive a mental health assessment while she awaits a ruling on a probation violation stemming from a 2019 no-contest plea to animal negligence. Hughes was arrested by Calaveras County Probation on Monday at their San Andreas office. Calaveras County Probation has recommended Hughes receive a term of 90 days in jail for her probation violation. Meanwhile, Calaveras County Behavioral Health will coordinate a mental health assignment. Judge Sanders set a probation violation pretrial date for March 3rd. Well, according to the U.S. Postal Service, a fake email scam claiming to be from the United States Post Office is making the rounds and has hit Amador and Calaveras counties fairly hard this week. The email will prompt you to open a little link. That link actually will activate a virus and steal information such as usernames, passwords, and financial account information on your computer. Postal Service is working to identify the individual or individuals behind this. In the meanwhile, they urge everyone receiving this email, do not, do not open it and contact the U.S. Postal Service or local authorities. Well, after long last, the town of Paloma will finally see a firehouse by summer. Thanks to the McCallum Hill Fire Protection District, the satellite station will be the town's first public building since 1963. The firehouse will rely almost entirely on volunteer labor and serve the town of 145 homes. Now, meanwhile, the fire district is looking for residents in the Paloma area to be trained as volunteer firefighters. You can visit McCallumyFire.org or call 286-1389 for more details. And Smiles for Kids 2020 was another big success. 46 kids were able to receive dental exams, x-rays, teeth cleaning, sealants, fluoride treatments, and emergency dental work at no charge. The dentists at Jackson Creek Dental Group, along with their staff and members of the community, volunteered their time to treat the local children with pro bono services totaling $15,000. A lot of the children seen this year did not need follow-up treatments and were in good dental health, which is always the goal. However, 15 children will be seen at Jackson Creek Dental Group for free follow-up treatments as part of the program. Six will be seen by specialists in Sacramento as part of the Sacramento District Dental Society's Adopt-a-Child Orthodontic and Specialty Referral Care Programs. Jackson Creek Dental been at this for over 34 years. Great group of dentists at Jackson Creek Dental. And again, a reminder for you, Mark Twain Medical Center now taking uh, reservations for their workshop titled Heart Health Equals Everything. The educational event will cover cardiovascular health as well as discussing resources provided by their cardiac service department. To guarantee a spot, contact uh, marketing manager Nikki Stevens. Nikki's number is 754-5919. This will take place on the uh, morning from 10 to noon, followed by a lunch on Valentine's Day at Mark Twain Medical Center. That's a quick look at the news on this Gold Country Friday, live from Louis Oliver's here at the uh, 
Beautiful Harrah's Northern California Casino in the Jackson Valley. Let's take a quick look at the weather forecast today. Uh, MC, you're missing a good one today. MC's back at the station. We've got 61 degrees currently on site. We're going for a high today of about 64. Beautiful weather all weekend long and unfortunately on into the week. MC, what do we have in the way of traffic? Uh, anything going on today? All clear on local roads, according to CHP. All right. Thank you, uh, MC. Don't forget, a uh, little tie-up today on uh, the Highway 49 between the Sutter Creek Bridge and Amador Creek Bridge along the uh, bypass there, holding up people anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes. So, All right. We're going to take a quick break and come back and talk with Rich and Paul from the Amador County Chamber of Commerce. And you want to talk, don't you? I, I'm going to talk. You, you, you I've been talk. talking. Yeah, but I mean, but you, you need got, me to talk. You, I can talk more. Urge to talk. <laughs> don't you? Hey, of course, we're, we're going to go to you right after the break. Sounds good. And you can talk yeah. about what the chefs may be bringing us out. Okay, we'll do. All right, we'll be back live from Louis Oliver's here at Harris, Northern California, in the beautiful Jackson Valley, in just a moment. Did you know that health disease is the number one killer of both men and women? A healthy heart is essential to overall health and well-being. You're invited to attend a free lunch seminar, Heart Health Equals Everything. Learn how to manage blood pressure, what specialized local resources are available, including new technology, and learn how to perform CPR. This all-in-one unique free seminar takes place on February 14th, 10 a.m. to noon at Mark Twain Medical Center. A complimentary lunch is included. Seating is limited. RSVP by February 10th. Call 754-5919. That's 754-5919. Hello, human kindness. There's no reason to be chicken. Shake up your morning at McDonald's with a sweet and savory chicken McGriddles, buttery McChicken biscuit, and crispy golden hash browns. Mix and match any two for just three bucks. Then add any size McCafe premium roast coffee for a dollar. It's time to wake up breakfast at McDonald's with chicken. Prices and participation may vary. Single item at regular price cannot be combined with any other offer or combo meal. Thirteen forty ninety six five KV. Where did Josh go? He was running around here a little while ago, and then now he. Did he, did he run to the kitchen? Okay, so he ran to the kitchen. Okay, we were just going to talk to him. But so we're here at Harris Northern California, Louis Oliver's, and Rich Hoffman, who's president of the uh, Amador Chamber of Commerce. Morning, Paul Molinelli is on the executive board. Yep. We're going to be here next Wednesday for our chamber mixer. Yeah, and we're super excited about it. And as uh, the chamber president, want to uh, send a special thanks out to Harris of Northern California for uh, their membership and hosting the mixer for the first time here mm -hmm. at uh, Louis Oliver's. Uh, as you said, next week, Wednesday the 12th from 5.30 to 7. Here. Right here. Yeah. Right here. $10. And Paul, can non-chamber members attend these events? Non-chamber members can attend these events and it's a good way to become familiar with the chamber so if if you're not if you're not a chamber member currently come to this next mixer in a great surroundings uh, find out what the chamber does and network with other chamber members and hopefully you know the will become a chamber member and for those that haven't you know been to a chamber mixer in the past what it is is you come and you pay ten dollars right right and it's a no host bar. There are there's beverages and there right. will be here. Right. Uh, and then there are there's food. And you sample food of the great food. Yeah. Yeah. And, and talk with the folks. Uh, a lot of the businesses will bring in a raffle prize. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that's there's right. There's a, a great the raffle. raffle as part of the evening as well. Yeah. And yeah. if you if you want some extra raffle tickets, you know, my wife Teresa helps run the raffle. What if you bring a raffle? How many uh, items, how many tickets do you get? Um, uh, see, like five? five, five um, 15 for 10, and but if I bring a gift, if I bring a gift for the raffle, five free, five, five free tickets. So there you go, five free tickets. There you go. So, yeah, it's awesome. Yeah. 
And then uh, that money, all the money's raised, goes back to uh, the chamber and to promoting business in Amador right. County. Right, promoting Amador County yeah. businesses and, and uh, all the good things they do. And it's a great time to network and a great time to learn uh, who the chamber members are and uh, talk about the programs that the mm -hmm. chamber is, uh, is involved in, too. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Chamber can help businesses of all sizes, not just the little ones can help mom and pops, especially right. mom and pop businesses, even household business, you know, even little cottage businesses too M you know mom and pop businesses and small businesses are the backbone of i in my opinion the u.s economy yeah if if mom and pop businesses are not doing well they're the ones who are creating jobs mm -hmm. that sustain for the long time and yeah. if you utilize and and do business with a local business uh that money is multiplied in the community yeah. so it's it's vitally important that small businesses so have thrive have either one of you been here yet I've been here. You've been here before? Yeah, okay. yeah absolutely. Have you, since, have you since, since my offices and headquarters for ACES are just <laughs> down the road, we do come here frequently for lunch. Yeah. Well, this is the first time I've been here for lunch, yeah. so I'm looking forward. And Josh is over there with a look at the food. Oh, my gosh. Look at the food. Now, he won't, now that I want to talk to him, he won't talk. Hey, Josh. Yeah, look at that. I'm here. This is amazing. What, what is all this? This is lunch. Wow. Serving lunch. So we have some of our uh, lunch items here. Um, we do a, an amazing grilled and chilled uh, shrimp cocktail. Our house Reuben with uh, the large onion rings. Uh, our house burger. Calamari fries. And we have our seasonal, uh, we brought it out for this season. Uh, it's our steak bowl. Uh, charcuterie board that we're doing all day oh. for lunch and dinner. Um, yeah, we try and to do as much uh, as much as we can, um, you know, yeah. uh, local. So, Josh, what what, uh, what are these guys eating right here? Are those just are those just some regular fries for them? Yep. Regular or oh, regular fries? Regular they look like fries. they might have been. They look puffy. Yeah, they look, look puffy. puffy. Look like they're. Kind yeah, of they're a, they're called sidewinder yeah. fries. Oh, okay. Nice. Is that the way they're cut? They, it's 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 good, they're more. They? Uh, it's a spiralized yeah, so kind of potato. Okay. I, not yeah, part of my low-carb diet, they, but they're, I might try one. Everybody loves them. We do a lot with those, too. Yeah. Now, do you have a different menu for for evening as you do for lunch? Same we do. Okay. We do. We have, we have a different menu for dinner that we do for lunch. So we go from lunch. Uh, we have a, a great happy hour uh, menu. Uh, we do some loaded fries with the same fries. We do some, some sliders. Uh, and then uh, we go into dinner. So dinner, more full menu, you mm -hmm. know, steaks. More seafood, pasta dishes. Gotcha. Yeah. All right. Looks good. Thank we'll you. Be, we'll be trying it, okay? Definitely. Mighty tasty. All right. Good deal. Thank you, Josh. All right. So maybe we'll be serving up some of this next next Wednesday. Boy, I, I hope know. so. You just don't know unless you, you come. Don't know. Unless but I can you tell right. you, the food will be great, mm -hmm. and the company will be great, and the networking opportunities will be great. And uh, we'd like to encourage everybody to come out and, and uh, join the chamber. Yeah, and it starts for it runs usually from about 5:30 to 7, mm -hmm. and raffle about 6:30 to 7, and then it's a uh, right. You know, er, easy, head back home and away you go, or stay here or and have dinner or here. We encourage you to stay and have dinner. Stay and have dinner. Yeah. Stay dinner. Yeah. Play a little bit. Yeah. 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 You never know. Yep. You never know. You just never know. Rich Hoffman, always President a pleasure, Jimmy, of the Amador Chamber. Paul Molinelli, I'd shake your hand, but oh, there we go. Thank you very much. There we go. Thank you, guys. All right, All right we'll be back live at, uh, what, what was that? Oh, okay. Oh, never mind. We'll be back live at uh, Louie Oliver's here at Harris, Northern California, the beautiful Jackson Valley. We're going to be talking with our friends from the Jackson Rotary. Jackson Rotary. Yeah. It's time for trivia when we come back. When the power goes out, your life is disrupted. Heat, air conditioning, refrigeration, phones, all gone. Want to take back control? A Generac Home Standby Generator protects your home against power outages every second of every day, all year long, automatically, whether you're home or away. Control your power, control your life with a Generac Home Standby Generator. For more information, contact your local Generac dealer, Short Circuit Electric, serving the area since 1977. Call for a free on-site survey or estimate today, 245-3269, or visit shortcircuitelectricinc.com. Generac and Short Circuit Electric, two names you can trust. Do you live within a two-mile radius of Highway 88 and have a disabling condition? Amador Transit has expanded their dial-a-ride service area. 
Call Amador Transit at 267-9395 and apply for the Dial-A-Ride program. Dial-A-Ride is an Amador Transit shared ride, curb-to-curb -curb transportation program for individuals who are unable to ride fixed route bus service due to disabling conditions. Call 267-9395 to apply or toll free at 1-877-704-4297. That's 1-877-704-4297. Thirteen forty ninety six five KVGC live at uh, Louis Oliver's here at uh, beautiful Harris, Northern California. <laughs> Josh, did you send that back? Get plated up. Yes. Okay. We're getting everything for everybody ready. Great. All right. We'll be looking forward to it. All right. Thank you. Hey, this that was dynamite, man. Excellent. But, but it's one of those, like you said, it's a sipping. Cocktail. It is. It is. It is a sippy cocktail. But today is Friday, and at Louis we do uh, gin Friday. It's uh, three dollar well gin all day here at Louis Oliver's. So you can get away with more than sippy drinks when you're doing the gin, so. Okay, it's a deal. All right. Thanks, all right, <laughs> we'll be talking with Josh in just a little bit. Josh, again, is the uh, director of food and, and uh, beverages here. Well, our old friends, that didn't come out too well, did it? Our, our <laughs> well, we long time are. friends, how's that? Long time Better. friends. Our Long and Marv Hampton are here Good today. How are you guys Thanks. doing? Thanks so for having us. We're talking trivia today. And you guys were in the studio a couple of weeks ago, and you tried to, uh, you know, stump me. But I was able to answer. Out of the 17 questions you asked me, I answered one. one. So that was good. Uh, Got that's a about few average. Yeah. <laughs> a Got a few more for you today, too. A dime has 110 ridges. How's that sound? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So today what I want you to do is we're going to ask everybody here in the audience today to okay. help us with a trivia question. So do you have a trivia question right now? Yeah, I do. Okay, let's ask it. Okay, everybody, listen up. Here's the trivia question, okay? What is the trivia question? Okay, question number one. <clears throat> Category is music slash entertainment. Music slash entertainment is the category. <clears throat> okay. The mother of Saturday Night Live alum, Maya Rudolph, was a famous singer who was well known for her five octave range. What was her name? Does everybody, did everybody hear that? Maya Rudolph's mother. Maya Rudolph's mother. Was a was famous a singer. Famous singer with a five octave range. Diana Ross. Diana Ross. Nope. nope. Mariah Carey. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> no. Nope. Anybody have an answer? Josh, you got the answer? I don't. No. No. <laughs> but you look like a guy that knows trivia. Uh, you know, I know some. Yeah, so here and there. Okay. All right, what's the answer? Minnie Ripperton. Minnie Pearl. What'd you say? <laughs> Minnie Ripperton. Minnie I know. Do you guys know? Any? I don't know any Minnie Ripperton. <laughs> Minnie Pearl. No, Minnie Ripperton. Yeah. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah. So this is coming up next month. It is March the seventh. All right. It's going to be at the Highway House. Correct. Uh, we start uh, checking folks in around. Uh, 2 p.m., game starts at 3, and we're usually done round 5. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of yeah, fun. Yeah, we, we play three rounds of trivia. Mm -hmm. uh, we have about 30 teams. Uh, there's four people in a team, and they have their own private table and can have their own private discussions over the questions that are uh, announced and mm -hmm. also uh, projected so that we don't have a lot of repeats. Uh, every round, uh, the time changes. Uh, we start with uh, uh, 40 seconds, yeah. go to 35, and then to the 30. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. As, as we move into the three rounds, it gets tougher and tougher because we speed it up. So what does it cost to put a team together? $100. $100 for a team. Right. And that can be anybody from a single person up to five? Four. 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 Up four. to four. Okay. And you've had single people in before? No. No. Okay. <laughs> Well, maybe I might uh, you know, enter it's, it's, this myself. You don't well, want to show up as a single. You have no one to blame. <laughs> yeah, you have to get your experts. And, you know, get anybody on. So. There we go. Yeah, Stan and I were going to do this one year, and we, we uh, had actually had a, we both had been called off. Very important uh, business couldn't attend. Yeah. Okay. So <laughs> this is coming up March. What's the date again? March the 7th. March the 7th. And it's, House. And it's fundraiser a fundraiser for for uh, for uh, Ryla Ryla Camp, right? Right. Yes. For, we send uh, six students uh, every year to 
Ryla Camp, and uh, every year the cost keeps going up, and we keep making, trying to make more and more money to send them. So uh, that's right. they are the recipients of uh, everything that uh, the rotor, the trivia challenge. Uh, and there'll be a producers. bar there. There'll be some light. Yeah, we have we have snacks? a table of finger food snacks. and uh, snacks and uh, a bar. So we're looking for for teams right now. Correct. Right? Yeah. All right. So yep. how do we sign up? Where do we go to sign up? Well, you can go to uh, our website, which is jacksonrotary.org, mm -hmm. and uh, right on the home page there will be a place for you to go uh, for the trivia challenge, and all the forms and everything you need to participate is there. Uh, and you sh should not have any trouble. If you do, you can call me at 209-217-6002, uh, and I'll see that you get the information. Are you pretty prolific in the computer, so if people have trouble, they can just you can tell them to go? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. The one thing I I am not uh, computer... Uh, Literate? Yeah, I, I am illiterate. No, no, no. Just... <laughs> I said you're not computer literate. I would right. say you're illiterate. So. Well, no. I've never read one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Again, that's coming up uh, in March. It'll be here before we know it. And it's $100 a team. A team of anyone from one person to four people can be on this team. And, again, all the money goes to the Ryla camp. And it's, that's a very great, great uh, And if you don't have a team and you just want to come and participate on your own, uh, $10 to get you in the door. You can just play for the fun of it and participate in the, right. in the food deal. and drink. All right. Here's, okay, everybody ready for the next trivia question? If you correctly identify, if you can correctly answer this trivia question, I will personally buy you the drink of the month. Wow. Okay. The next yeah. one's an easy one. <laughs> 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 All right. What's the answer? What's the question? Okay. Uh, the category is islands. Islands. The question is, name the world's largest island. Name the world's largest island. Greenland. You got it. Greenland? I'll, I'll score up with you later. <laughs> I do have one more. One more. One I know, more. Double or nothing. Here we go. I know one you're more. a big sports fan. Yeah, one more. Okay, so this category is sports. Sports. Who's the only head basketball coach? To have won both an NCAA title and an NBA title. Only only basketball coach to win an NBA and an and NCAA. An NCAA title. <laughs> it is nobody knows? Come on. I don't think it's John Walton. Well you were you were half right. It wasn't Larry Bird, but it was Larry Brown. Larry Brown. Larry Brown. Larry Brown. Okay, there we go. Did you know that, Josh? I I think I knew that. You th thought you yeah, knew. Okay, it's possible. Get some a drink there. It's good. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for being with us. Hey, today. it's a pleasure. Thanks, right. Jim. Do you, do you have a night show? We've done the morning. We've done the noon. <laughs> Why don't you show up tonight? It's nine o'clock. Right. Nine hey, o'clock. Yeah, huh? you'll be the only guest. <laughs> the only person there too. But Thanks be, for having us. Be a lot of fun. Thank you guys. Hey, we'll be back live here at uh, Louis Oliver's in just a moment. It's time to play KVGC Radio Bingo. Your chance to win weekly prizes and qualify for the grand prize of one thousand dollars cash. Once you've filled in five merchant boxes in a row, you've got a bingo. Ready? Let's play. Be memorable. Create custom apparel for your business. JB's Awards and Custom Apparel can screen print or embroider your logo on sweatshirts, workwear, t-shirts, aprons, caps, and more. Call JB's today to find out how affordable it can be. 223-1353. Now remember, for a complete list of rules and more details on KBGC Radio Bingo, visit our website, kbgcradio.com. You know that your IRA is 100% taxable, but did you know that when your heirs inherit your IRA, it is still 100% taxable? For example, if you worked your whole life to save $100,000 in IRA money to leave to your heirs, they may only end up with $60,000 after taxes are paid. This is insane. It's your money. You should be able to leave it all to your heirs. 
To learn concepts that can help keep your estate intact and allow you to leave a potentially tax-free inheritance, call me, William Peterson, at 1-800-545-4209. That's 1-800-545-4209. CRD number 5600402, California Life License 0707620. Investment advisory services offered through Brookstone Capital Management, LLC, a registered investment advisor. BCM and William Peterson Financial Planning are independent of each other. Insurance products and services are not offered through BCM, but are offered and sold through individually licensed and appointed agents. 1340-965, KVGC. Let's go back to Josh. He's going to talk a little bit about some, some local aspects at the bar here. Yes. So here at uh, Louis Oliver's, we're trying to bring in as much of the local community as we can, uh, part of our food and beverage program. So some of the wines that we have uh, by the glass, or served by the glass and by the bottle, we have Helwig, uh, two options for Terra de Oro, as well as 1850, and of course, uh, Amador Distillery's Engine 49 line. Um, it's fantastic additions to our program, and uh, you know, as time goes on, we'll, we'll definitely be bringing in more uh, to embrace sure. the local wine community here mm -hmm. at uh, up in up in Jackson area. Yeah, yeah. You know, when you go about choosing the l alcohol that you serve in a bar or in a restaurant, a wine list, for example, how do you go about doing that? Well, wine wine is. Uh, Wine's an interesting thing. So for me, why go outside of California when we have such an amazing wine country all in Northern California? So for me, it was a matter of bringing in um, as much local and regional wine and obviously uh, spirits that we could. Uh, so not only do we have Amador Distillery, we have St. George, a line of St. George product. Um, we have for beer, we're, we have Amador uh, Brewing uh, by, by, by the bottle and on tap as well. So again, it's just what we can do to really embrace, embrace our neighbors and really show them support by, by having them on our program. So, Great. Thank you, Josh. Thank you. All right. Well, Christy Roots. We've got a blood drive coming up, huh? We have a blood drive coming yeah, up. Yeah, step up to the microphone oh, and sorry. tell everybody about it. Oh, blood drive on Monday, um, February 10th, 1.30 mm -hmm. to 5.30, Evelyn Bishop Hall. And again, how much are we, I always ask you this, and, and are we ahead, behind, are we even, did uh, we catch up? I would say it's up? probably we... safe to say we're always behind because the need for blood is so great. Just so continues to accidents, escalate, escalate. sicknesses. People um, stop donating. People mm -hmm. lose, you know, become ineligible for various reasons. Has there been any talk about with the with this, um, you know, the the new coronavirus? Are <sighs> that's going to affect? I, I'm sure it will. Um, it hasn't. I haven't heard anything yet mm -hmm. on that. But again, you're supposed to feel well and healthy, and I'm yeah. I'm assuming they would defer you if you were in any. <laughs> Who's given the most? I know one time we were talking with, when mm -hmm. we were at the National, we were talking with Stan and we were talking about uh, Pat Crosby who had given a milk can. He had the milk can right. award. Is there anyone that's close to that in, you know, in, uh, you uh, know contemporary times? Um, you Not know, that Pat there, wasn't in contemporary. Uh, yeah, there, there's a lot of people that donate very regularly, mm -hmm. six times a year, but a lot of people also donate blood components. So they can donate. Um, so what is a blood component? Um, plasma, platelets, or red blood cells. And oh, okay. if you do like a double red cell, you can only donate every 16 weeks. But if you can, if you donate plasma or platelets, you can donate um, mm -hmm. twice a week. I mean, you can donate very, very frequently. Really? So there are some people that have an amazing amount of plasma oh. or platelets. And Mike, you've given blood before, haven't you? Yes. What's it like? What do, you, what do you do when you go there? You know, actually, it's it's uh, it's kind of fun because uh, you have the same people there every that, every eight weeks. <laughs> yeah, and she usually is when I'm giving blood too. Um, <laughs> but uh, you see the same people every eight weeks, um, and now that they have, uh, you can go online before you go there and fill out your information. So by the time you walk in, so now it's a lot faster even. 
and then uh, it's my excuse to get nutter butters. Because <laughs> nutter butters. So when you go there now, do you just carry the, the info on your phone and scan it, or do yeah. you bring papers? Or how no, do you, you, you can um, go on. They have a new fast track on Vitalent, mm -hmm. and you can do your all your questions the day of, and then you just walk in. They do your... Um, I missed the last one the first time they did it, but I believe they just do your well check and then you're donating. So it's 16 or 17 with an adult, with, with, with a parent, parent parental. Yeah. You have to weigh at least 110 pounds, is it? I, yeah, you know, it's one of those things that doesn't affect me. So it's 110 or 115. Okay. I can't and remember. And the way I uh, always figure out, I've got everything beat three <laughs> times over. So, you know, <laughs> they do. Do it, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> and then you should be in good physical Good. Well, Condition. feeling well feeling and healthy, good. yes. Right. Yeah. No runny noses, no coughs. No, no coughs. I mm -hmm. would probably say if you were on the cruise ship in the last week, you probably shouldn't show up. Or if just you were in China. <laughs> in China, 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 you probably China. shouldn't show yeah. up. Um, All right, so this is coming up on Monday. Monday, yep. Evelyn Bishop Hall. Yes. And interesting hours. The hours are? one thirty to 5.30. Exactly. It's different from, from the, from the um, American Legion. It's a little bit later. And you're able to hit the people that are working, which Hopefully I think is a good idea. Hopefully, if they're getting off work, then yeah. they can stop by. Great. Yes. All right. Guys, thanks for coming. We wouldn't be, it wouldn't be an interview without how's the basketball team going. Have you talked, you know, to, doing real have good. You talked to your daughter lately? <laughs> <laughs> yes, a lot. Uh, we have a big game tonight. Uh, tonight would be uh, uh, both of us are in for the league championships, so uh, whoever wins is most likely going to win league. So You're playing Calaveras? Calaveras, Calaveras tonight. Tonight. So yeah, at home. Girls then so boys. it'll be a big, big game. Yeah, the varsity girls play tonight and the varsity boys play tonight. Yeah, so be a big one. it All should right. be a real good game. Well, we're looking forward to going to. Don't want to jinx anybody, but we're looking forward to going <laughs> down to uh, Golden One uh, Center again. It was great for our guys because it was like being, you know, it, it it just works from the from the floor on up. It's like they're playing in the big times. It's like you're coaching in the big times. Well, all the way up in the broadcast booth. All we had to do was just plug cords and everything was there for us. <laughs> Monitors, screens, court mics, everything was there. It was great coverage. It is a nice stuff. place. Yeah, it was beautiful. It was beautiful. So, All right, so let's give blood. Give the gift of life. Again, this is coming up. Sponsored by Christy Roots Insurance. This coming Monday from 1.30 to 5.30. Evelyn Bishop Hall. How many... How many units can you, I mean, how many beds are there at a time? There's about 10 beds open. About 10? There. Okay. Yeah. So, but you're usually in and out in less than an hour. And go to Vitalent. Vitalent. Is it vitalent.com, vitalent.org? Vitalent.org. To, to sign up ahead yeah. of time. All right. And you can do it on your smartphone right in the parking lot if you want. Yeah. So. Good deal. Yeah. All right. Thanks for coming in today. Good luck tonight. Thank you. Hey, thank you. All right. Hey, we'll be back. We're going to talk with Josh. We're going to wrap it up with Wendy and more live from uh, Louis Oliver's here at Harrow's Northern California, the beautiful Jackson Valley. Give your computer a year-end present. The Computer Depot offers the cleanup for your system. Let us check for viruses, malware, and your antivirus upgrades. We'll also clean out your system of dust and dirt, which can shorten the life of your computer. And when was the last time you backed up your important data? We'll also back up your documents and pictures to an 8 gigabyte USB memory stick. All of this for just $75. Call the Computer Depot today at 257-3009 to set up a time to give your computer the ultimate year-end present. Established 1989 with professional computer experience since 1972. Trust experience, trust the Computer Depot. Located behind KVGC on Main Street, Jackson. Hi, I'm Floyd Martin, past state commander of the American Legion. I'd like to address those veterans that aren't members of the American Legion or those that might have let their membership expire. Your voice, along with our other 2.7 million members, can and will be heard. Help us protect our American values and veterans' benefits as we continue to serve for God and country. Call 267-5764 or 267-9436 and join today. Thank you. 1340-965 KVGC live at Stanley Steakhouse here at the National Hotel. We give... Uh, Told Josh he could put the mic down and relax, and uh, maybe 
you're on duty, right? So you can't try right. one of those delicious drinks. Yeah. And well, you know, part of being in in the food and beverage is to always try things to make sure everything is coming out good. So you know. So you, we we've had some great food here today. In fact, I'm going to sample some. I'm going to eat before I go home. Excellent. Um, you didn't mention the chef's name. Uh, chef uh, Joe DeBorg. Okay. Yep, Chef Joe has been with us for a little bit. Um, he's got a tremendous background in banquets, and he fit right into the team, and uh, it's been great so far. So let's talk about that, Josh. I see you have the tent out, out here, and yes. we talked to, to JC about it earlier, and he said that's kind of where you do some special events. Let's say I want to have a large function out here. I want to have a dinner, two, 300 people. Can you accommodate it with that tent? Can we can we work out of here with yeah, this? Yeah, we can definitely work on on something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can we can definitely work something out to to accommodate it as much as we can. Yeah. Oh yeah. So, do you want people to get to, to contact you with that? Or That'd you, be great. Are you into that uh, right yeah, now. Yeah, it's that... it's something we're we're exploring the opportunity to do that. So mm -hmm. yeah, if anybody's interested in doing that, they feel yeah. free to reach out to us here right, at, the, at the property. Here's, here's my next question. Yes. What is the number one seller at at Louis Oliver's? Ooh. There's a lot of good things on the menu. Um, between the burger and our fall menu right now, the steak bowl has been doing really well. The steak bowl? The steak bowl, yep. It's our uh, steak trimmings and teriyaki sauce over a bed of white rice. I, I think everybody should have had a sample of that. I keep smelling barbecue sauce. Is, is somebody having barbecue around here somewhere? We we don't do barbecue, but we do gr do some great steaks. Something that has because yes. I keep smelling it. I keep looking around for it. And I don't <laughs> see it on my. I see a Reuben on my. And a, yeah. And a, uh, a uh, onion, ring. onion ring. Onion rings. Onion rings. There. Yes. So there we go. All yeah. right, Josh. Thank you very much. Thank Thanks you for the hospitality. It was Appreciate great. it. Thank you very thank much. You. All right. Wendy from Hospice is with us today. Wendy, thanks for coming out here today. Thanks for having me. And uh, again, your drink of the month was delicious. It was delicious. What was that yes. called again, Josh? That was it's the, the um, espresso chocolate martini. Espresso chocolate martini. Okay, it was great. It was. It was delicious. Very delicious. Doing that. Oh, it's for our us. pleasure. Yeah. So, a portion of the proceeds, a portion goes to Hospice of Amador and Calaveras, and we uh, want you to come out and order one of those. So. So let's talk a little bit about your Take a Chance on Love drawing next Friday. Friday we'll be we're up at Hospice, the thrift store. Tickets Friday. going right now? Yeah, we're in the home stretch right now. Mm -hmm. So um, we're just trying. We have seven more days to try to sell as many tickets uh, as possible. So um, tickets are $10 each, or you can buy $100 worth of tickets and double your tickets. So you get 20 tickets for $100. Um, with $100 purchasers, there's also, uh, we have sponsors, which is the Murphy's Hotel and mm -hmm. Small Town Wine Bar that are going to give you a little added incentive um, for buying a $100 ticket. I'm going to excuse you, just, yeah. Josh, I did something on purpose. What's that? kind of testing you. How long has this onion ring been out here? 10 minutes? About 10, 15 minutes. Still crunches. Excellent. <laughs> I will let Chef Joe know. Did that. you hear me when I was? I actually had to turn my mic off because I bit into it. I thought, well, this will be good. I'll just bite into this thing, and no one will know. And then uh, it was crunchy. So nice, good job. Appreciate good it. Job. Good job. Good job. So to get tickets, what do we do? Tickets. You can visit our thrift store, either thrift store locations, Jackson or Angels Camp. Mm -hmm. Visit our office um, at 1500 South Highway 49 online at hospiceofamador.org. Mm -hmm. um, you can also order them by phone. Just call and do a credit card by phone and we'll mail your tickets out to you. Great. Um, or if you call me next week, I'll be happy to deliver them to your business or... Um, Good deal. Yeah. All right. It's a great, one of our favorite uh, groups. Uh, Josh, you couldn't have chosen a better uh, organization to give the part of the proceeds to the drinks too. Yeah, we're, we're yeah. definitely great. glad to be a part of it. Yeah, great. All right. Wendy, thank you. Thank you for okay. having me. Buy those tickets. Get buy those tickets buy right tickets. now. Yeah, All right. Or... When we come back, we're going to wrap it up from Louie Oliver's with uh, Sam and Jordan in just a moment, live from the Jackson Valley. We'll be back. Are you looking for a Christ-centered, Bible-believing, spirit-filled church? The friendly congregation at the Sutter Creek Baptist Church invites you to come worship the Lord with hymns and words of praise during their Sunday worship service at 10.30 a.m. 
Sutter Creek Baptist Church, located at 250 Hanford Street in Sutter Creek, across from the Days Inn. Email Sutter Creek Baptist Church at gmail.com. Come as a guest, stay as a friend. Don't miss February specials, gaming promotions, tournaments, and giveaways. With Harris' connection to Caesars Rewards, players have more access to benefits than ever before. Caesars Rewards members earn privileges and preferred access to Caesars Resorts and amenities in Las Vegas, Lake Tahoe, and around the world, including exclusive events, promotions, and offers, pre-sale tickets for select shows at resorts nationwide. This month's drink of the month at Louis Oliver's get a chocolate espresso martini. Made with a white chocolate liqueur, espresso vodka, half and half, plus a raspberry liqueur, $2 of every drink sold will go to Hospice of Amador and Calaveras. And spend Valentine's Day with the one you love at Louis Oliver's with a very special menu. Get an appetizer, entree, and dessert, plus a glass of champagne for just $75 per couple. Call 209-790-4554 to make your reservation today. And around Amador County this week, don't miss the annual Love Affair Ball. It will be held Saturday, February 8th. The dinner dance includes an elegant prime rib dinner or rosemary chicken dinner, benefit auction, special Valentine's favors, and dancing, all to benefit the Amador County Fair Foundation. And local author Kevin T. Hunt will discuss her upcoming mystery series, Maiden's Grave, Sunday, February 9th from 2 to 4 p.m. at Heinen Company Bookstore on Main Street, Jackson. Enjoy tea, scones, and a special chocolate treat. For more details on these events, visit kvgcradio.com or go to norcal-fund.com. Harris Northern California Casino, with 950 rotating slots, 20 of the hottest table games, and blockbuster promotions. You'll never be bored at Harris Northern California, located in the beautiful Jackson Valley. 1340, 90, that's what I tell everybody, 1340, 96.5, KVGC, live from Harris, Northern California, Louis Oliver's in the beautiful Jackson Valley today. Speaking of beautiful, Sam and Jordan are with us today. Ladies, thanks for coming on and helping us wrap the show up today. Yes. And uh, very nice. Thank you very much for extending the invitation for us to be yeah, here today. Of course. Thank it you was, for coming. It was great. So, February, I know uh, I heard your ad on the radio about an event coming up. Uh, around Valentine's Day for couples kind of here at Louis Alvarez? Yes, absolutely. So we've got a menu all sorted out. Um, it includes a choice of appetizer, entrees for each, of course, and a choice of dessert. And, uh, oh, two glasses of champagne are included. Mm -hmm. But you can upgrade to Intercoastal's Sparkling Rosé. We're a big fan. Okay, so. great. Yes. What else? Uh, what else? Well, we do have we have our drink of the month as well that you were able to try. Else? What else is going on? Oh, what do we have in February? Well, February we're ramping up. I mean, we're we're kind of uh, looking at our our menu and seeing what we're going to change for spring. We're going forward. We're um, just really. Are you working on the on the one year anniversary? We are. We're planning some some fun things. We um, we are thinking just as. As a listener sneak peek, um, we are planning in, in May something something really, really great to celebrate Harris turning one years old. It's almost right. our birthday. So, right. yes, we do have a, a great party planned. And then Amador County Chamber will be back out here on Wednesday. Yes. Yes. For the uh, We'll be hosting mixer. our first mixer here on property. Mm -hmm. So we are gearing up. Everyone's involved. I mean, you've met Josh now, yeah. so you know how <laughs> he is just in love with, you know, coming up with events and, and being involved. Will it be inside, outside? Where, where, where's well, it it be will at? be inside, so we'll be blocking off the, the this half of the restaurant, mm -hmm. the back half of the restaurant, and we'll have some, you know, food and yeah. drinks. and. This looks like a natural stage area almost. Do, do you do things here? Yeah, or? if you can kind of, this, this little area where we're in, it does become a stage. So this kind of 
Um, we do have a stage that was built in, so we can install the stage. As you can see, the lights and all of that. Oh, you um, it is meant for us. us. That's, <laughs> oh, maybe should I ruined it? <laughs> yeah, Here I wore my makeup and everything. <laughs> but yeah, we, we can install a stage and, and have entertainment, yeah. and so there's just this room is so versatile, and we can do so many mm -hmm. things. Um, but for this chamber mixer, we are planning on having it inside. Um, but as as we warm up in the next few months, these these doors these they doors open up, open and up. we can yeah. have a beautiful that, patio area. I like that look when the doors when they slide open. Yeah. Like that. Mm -hmm. like that. All right. Hey, thank you very much again for extending the invitation for us to be of here. Course. It was nice to talk with Rhonda and JC, and of course we got to mention uh, got to mention Josh. Want to He's thank our him. superstar. Yeah, yeah, we got to meet so <laughs> many people today. Yes, yeah, it thank was. you for so, coming down. Yeah, we'll come back down again maybe and. Uh, you know, this was a nice time. It was a nice Perfect. time, so thank Sounds you. Good. We invite everybody to come back for dinner tonight. Dinner is when? Tonight? 5 to 10. Five, 5 to 10, dinner tonight? Yes. Yes, 5 to 10, five dinner to tonight. 5 to 10, and make your reservations for the Valentine's Day menu. I, I, I trust you. I just wanted him to feel like he was doing something. Oh, oh gotcha, gotcha. Right. <laughs> hey, that's going to wrap it up live from Louie Oliver's here in Harris, <laughs> Northern California, and the beautiful Jackson Valley for this week. We'll talk to you next week. Take care, everyone. Have a safe weekend. Yay. Bye, thanks.